Hello, welcome to the Octa Support Playlist. Today we'll be talking about the different user statuses that you will see in the admin console. The user account status provides information about the user account and whether administrative or user action is required. The user account status is displayed in the status column on the people page and on the user's individual profile page. To access the people page in the admin console, go to directory, people. The first status we'll discuss is staged. Accounts have a staged status when they are first created, before the activation flow is initiated, or if there is a pending admin action. An account in staged status can be activated by an admin from the people page by clicking on the activate link. The next status is pending user action. Accounts have a pending user action status when they are provisioned, but the user has not provided verification by clicking through the activation email or provided a password. The next status is active. Accounts have an active status when one, an admin adds a user to the people page and sets the user password without requiring email verification. Two, an admin adds a user on the people page, sets the user password, and requires the user to set their password when they first sign in. Three, a user self-registers into a custom app or the Okta homepage and email verification is not required. And finally, four, an admin explicitly activates a user's account, changing it from one of the other statuses back to active. Next is password reset. Accounts have a password reset status when a user requests a password reset or an admin initiates one on their behalf. Next is password expired. Accounts have a password expired status when the password has expired based on the criteria of the password policy assigned to the account and the account requires an update to the password before a user is granted access to the applications. Next is locked out. Accounts have a locked out status when the user exceeds the number of login attempts defined in the password policy. Next is suspended. Accounts have a suspended status when an admin explicitly suspends them. The user cannot access applications, the admin console, or the Okta end user dashboard. Application assignments are unaffected and the user's profile can still be updated. Finally, the last status is deactivated. Accounts have a deactivated status when an admin explicitly deactivates or deprovisions them. All application assignments are removed and the password is permanently deleted. Users in this status can be reactivated, but they'll need to set up their password and any other authenticators again during their first login. We hope this video has helped provide some clarification on the different user statuses that you will see in the admin console. Thanks for watching. For more Octus support videos, check out the Octus support playlist.